The Environment Agency is taking a number of steps towards modernising how we manage our assets. The development and operation of the Smart Object Library is another step towards doing this. The Smart Object Library uses established industry software tools that have been adopted across both the Environment Agency and our supply chain. The smart objects we have created align with our core asset types and are compliant with the object standards for strategic or conceptual designs, as found in the Data Requirements Library. These objects support rapid prototyping, optioneering for strategic decision-making and support the associated cost and carbon decisions. A well-designed object library helps us to develop models for visualising, designing and analysing our assets early in the development process. The analysis of the associated data will help us deliver our efficiency, sustainability and zero carbon targets. What's more, these models can be used in further analysis and for use by the supply chain in developing design and construction content. The library is there to support and enable future innovation, as well as meeting our key government strategy commitments. It allows for the efficient and repeatable development of commonly used assets, while also setting the benchmark for our key deliverables. As well as these key strategic benefits, the Smart Object Library also fulfills a number of core benefits for the Environment Agency. The library leads to cost savings to both us and our supply chain through the quick and easy development of outline design objects. It also leads to time savings through the reuse of our smart objects. Finally, the new smart object library is a vital step in mitigating risks and for creating a better certainty around our outputs. The library allows us to create assured and verified content that can be trusted. This reduces the risk in the development of outputs from the models, giving greater certainty in areas that include material quantification. This all adds up to achieving our ambition of creating a library that promotes the use and reuse of design content in a standard way across the Environment Agency and our supply chain.